Good morning, everyone. So as we're approaching the holiday shopping season, and some of you have already started, and basically you're heeding to the advice you're hearing on the news, shop early because, you know, crap. Um, you know, you got all these boats sitting out in the ocean and supply chain issues, chip shortage, so on and so forth. So if computers are on your list of things to buy for Christmas or just because they're on sale, don't buy this piece of crap here. No, or any other of these pieces of crap that are similar to this. If it has something like this in it, where it says it's a 32 gigabyte uh, EMC, which is basically the hard drive, any laptop, mini or otherwise, that has a hard drive that is smaller than 120 gigabytes, don't buy it. It's crap, absolutely worthless. I physically have one on the workbench here. I've been playing with and tinkering with it. The hard drive is welded to the main board. You can't, unless you're very good at soldering, you can't replace it. Um, they, in the, the motherboard that's on my workbench, there is the intentions of putting an M.2 slot in it so you can change out the hard drive. It was never added to the motherboard. The design is there where you could solder one in if you knew what you were doing, but no. Uh, absolutely not. So if you're looking for computers this holiday season, avoid this crap here. I get this every, for the past three Christmases, uh, around about January, people start coming in. They got these pieces of crap laptop, and this is true. Dell's got one too. I think it's called an HP Mini Inspiron. Uh, although they have an improvement uh, this year, I'm saying they actually put 128 gigabyte SSDs in versus this crap um but yeah if it's got anything less than 120 gigabytes on the hard drive whether it be emmc ssd theta whatever um, and if you're not sure if you're looking at one call me uh, or call us tell us what you're looking at we'll look it up and say yay or nay um but yeah um 250 for this and it's basically a brick after all the windows 10 updates go through the hard drive is full it won't do anything else you can't save anything now i have a solution uh for it for my use and i can make that available uh to everyone else because we do offer virtual hard drive services um but i've tested it on this one and it works it's just a little bit slower than i would like but it will do the job so Basically, it's like using Google Drive or using uh, OneDrive from Microsoft. We have a virtual hard drive system that you can utilize too. Um, and so you just let me know how much space you need and we can add it to it. But it shows up as a second drive on your mini. But <clears throat> like I said, this is a piece of crap. Don't buy it. it, it even for Black Friday, even the, the first year these came out, they were a Black Friday special for $99. Everyone thought it was a great deal. Uh, and they bought a ton of them. I think within, like I said, I want to say by February after Christmas, people, I, I think I must have seen 20 of these come in. And, and the hard drives were full uh, because there was just no hard drive space for them. Uh, you know, once you get on all the Windows updates, it's done. It's a brick. Uh, it's excessively slow. You could barely open up things because there's no hard drive space for it to you so and you can't change it out it's welded to the hard board or welded to the main board so yeah don't buy this crap um if you're not sure if you have questions while you're shopping feel free to give us a call let us know what you're looking at we'll look it up we'll tell you yay or nay um and that's just we do this every year so on the other thing you know we do have we're hoping to have because of the, the shopping supply chain issues and so on and so forth, all these boats. This is going to be probably the year of small business for holidays. Just a thought, uh, simply because we buy in such small quantities as a small business, not just us, but a lot of other people. Uh, we buy in such small qualities uh, that, you know, like if we're buying from out of country, which most of us try not to do, but if we do buy from out of country, they could put it on a plane and ship it to us. Um, you know, uh, like if I buy parts and I have no other place to get them but to China, China puts it in, on a plane and bring it over on a plane, then it gets to wherever the international port and then drops into DHL or 
FedEx or whatever, and then gets to me. So your smaller businesses this year are probably going to do relatively well um, for the Christmas holiday season because we can get stuff faster than the big chains. Um, I've got somebody who was telling me for Target that their stores are running a little bit thin um, simply because there are so many boats and so many ports that are just sitting there. They can't get them unloaded um, or unloaded fast enough. Don't give me the whole conspiracy theories. We all know what's going on. Just no, don't do that. But um, the boats can't get unloaded. So you have to remember these big corporate chains, they're buying stuff by the boatloads and then they distribute it out to their individual stores. Well, when the boats can't get unloaded or the trucks can't get loaded, then you have supply chain disruptions where the smaller businesses where we're not buying in bulk like that, we can actually go to the manufacturers or someone else and say, hey, ship it to me. And it's usually shipped to us in a few days to a week. Um, and so, you know, price might be a little bit higher, but it's going to be here a lot faster. And so I know I just put out an advertisement of the desktop computers and laptops we have in stock. And of course, you know, a list of some of our supplies we just recently acquired. We have more laptops that are in the development of being repaired for refurbished sales. So hopefully we have another, geez, uh, 12 or 13 laptops that will be available here relatively soon in the next week or so. So yeah, um, if computers are on your list, uh, definitely shop around. If you got questions, give us a call. We'll be glad to help help you out or you can buy it through us. Um, yeah, we got to market up to make a little bit of money, but hey, that's the life of a small business owner. Um, other things, let's see, I'm trying to think. Um, that's pretty much it for now. If uh, you've been paying attention, you know I had a, uh, a biopsy uh, earlier this week. Um, procedure went well, still waiting for results. So anyways, that's the video for this week. I thought I'd get that out there because I didn't have anyone uh, scheduled. Usually I'm uh, a couple weeks in advance, but things just have um, been up and down for us here. So one, you know, two or three days, we're just buried. I can't do anything. And then I've got medical and dental and everything else going on. So anyways, uh, you guys have a great day. I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.